Now, back to my big model. These are the wings. They're also called airfoils, and they have a special shape, and I'll talk about that in a few minutes. This is the body of the aircraft, known as the fuselage. So fuselage, airfoil. We have the nose of the aircraft. We have the tail of the aircraft. Now, you'll notice that uh, these have all got different parts. You'll notice on, the, on our wing, we have a set of slats here and here that move up and down. They move together. They create, their job is to create drag, to slow the plane down. They're called the flaps. Okay, so they'll come down. If you were on, on an air, aircraft and you're sitting behind the, the wing, it's really neat to watch. Uh, when you come into land, you'll see, you'll hear a funny sound and you look out the window and here's the back of the wing moving out and down. And then sometimes the little pieces come up on, on the top part and they, they're called spoilers, and they also create more drag. And it slows the plane down so we land at a slow enough, a slow speed. Now, the two on the outside, out here and here, are called ailerons. Now, you'll notice when I move my stick, the ailerons move, but they move opposite each other. And they create a four. Now, so I'll move it this way, and you'll notice the air flows over and under this wing, but now this aileron is down. The air underneath hits it, slows up, creates high pressure, pushes this wing tip up. This one, the air hits my uh, right aileron. The air on top this time is slowed up, creates pressure, pushes this wing tip down, and we do this. That's called roll. So I'm rolling to my right. So now when I go to the other side, this time the air pressure builds up underneath, lifts this wing tip up. Air pressure builds up on top, pushes this wing tip down, and I roll to the left. Okay, so that is roll. Uh, I'll try to use these words as much as possible to make it a little simp, uh, so you get used to using this new language that you're, you're learning today. Now, on the tail, we have four pieces. We have one here, we have one here, we have one here, and we have one here. These two do not move normally. They do not move. They're called stabilizers. The stabilizer's job is exactly what the, the name says. They stabilize the plane. In other words, they're designed so that the aircraft tail will follow the nose of the aircraft. If it gets out of alignment a bit, it will move the aircraft back into proper alignment. Okay, so those are called the stabilizers. These are not airfoils. They are not the same shape as our wings. Now the moving parts, this one is called the elevator. And just like an elevator in a building, they take people up and down. Well, the elevator on the airplane moves the aircraft up and down. So if I pull back on my stick, you'll notice that it tips up. The air flowing over top slows down, builds up pressure, pushes my tail down, and the aircraft climbs. So when I push it forward, I get the opposite effect. Air underneath builds up, air pressure builds up, lifts my tail, and we go down. That motion of up and down is called pitch. Now, the, the third one is called the rudder. And the rudder is very same as a rudder on a boat. It does exactly the same thing. But in this case, we operate it with our feet. We have rudder pedals here. So if I push with my left foot, my rudder points this way, the air pressure builds up on this side, takes my tail this way, and I turn to the left. If I push with the right foot, air pressure builds up on this side, 
moves my tail this way and I turn to the right. That motion is called yaw. So this motion is roll, this motion is pitch, this motion is yaw. Now I've talked about them as being uh, the pilot does this or he does this or he does that. In reality he does all three at the same time. Because when you're flying along and he wants to land over here somewhere, he's going to roll it a bit, he's going to give it a little bit of rudder pedal and he's going to go down and he's going to nice smooth then he'll correct to line it up and then we'll, he drops it down onto the runway or whatever. So he uses all three at the same time. Now, this we refer to as a stick. In this case, it is a stick. In a lot of aircraft, we have a stick, but it has a wheel at the top, a steering wheel. It does exactly the same as this, except instead of going side to side, I turn the wheel. It does exactly the same thing, it moves my ailerons.